Well, as we know, in total, 19 children and two adults died yesterday in that horrific attack at Robb Elementary School. Many of the victims' identities are starting to be revealed, including these three young girls, cousins, Annabelle Rodriguez and Jackie Cazares, and their classmate, Amarillo Garza. News Nation's Robert Sherman is also live in Uvalde. And of course, Robert, we know today that town is grieving. So many people there have some connection to the school or somebody in that school. You think about it, Nicole, 21 total victims here uh, in this shooting that took place yesterday. The, the, what we've found is, is that walking around this community, there's only one or two degrees of separation between just about everybody we've met and the people who died inside of that building. You talk to anyone, they either know someone or know someone who knows someone. It just goes to show how interwoven this whole community is. As you said, we are learning new information about the victims tonight. Here's one for you. Two of them were cousins, both of them in the exact same classroom. That would be on the left, you have Annabelle Rodriguez. You're looking at those photos there. And then Jackie Cazares, who's on the right, both of them just 10 years old. Their aunt confirming their death was saying, quote, my beautiful angels, at least you are together, but our hearts are broken in a million pieces. We love you. Here's another one of their classmates, Amory Jo Garza. She just turned 10 years old mere weeks ago. Her father, Angel, is pictured, pictured here and said, quote, please don't take a second for granted. Hug your family, tell them you love them. He later added, I will never feel happy or complete ever again. Those are really hard words to hear, Nicole. And you walk around this community, you talk to parents who say is that even though they didn't, may have not have lost a child in that shooting, they feel as though that it may as well have been their own child. It just goes to show how tightly knit everyone is here. There are a flurry of emotions in this community right now. A lot of people, of course, heartbroken. Some are angry. Just about everyone we've spoken with, though, utterly struck and shocked by what has happened and they're all asking the same question why why did this happen here nicole yeah question uh, so many of us are asking robert thank you thank you for watching click the red subscribe button below so you can get more of news nation's fact-driven unbiased coverage